Hi everyone, this is Dave, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you the best iPhone 7 Plus cases from a company called Rink. Now I have actually reviewed their products many, many times, and they make a fantastic range of cases for plenty of different smartphones. I'll leave links to all of these ones in the video description. So let's kick things off with a look at this one. This is the Fusion case for the iPhone 7 Plus. Now I've left the actual covers in place because this is the sort of attention to detail that Rink give their cases. When they ship these, they have a plastic film on the back and on the inside of the back so that this arrives to you in pristine condition. And then you peel these off once you've sort of installed your phone into the case. Now this is a clear case. It's quite a rigid sort of silicon material. It's got raised edge profile buttons for the power on off and the volume up and down, and then cutouts for all of the other controls and ports. It's also got a nice large cutout on the back for that dual camera, the microphone and the flash. Now, one of the things I did notice from previous generations of this particular case is the little port cover has disappeared. Of course, with the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, there's no three and a half millimeter headphone jack to cover, but I did like the little port that covered the lightning connector, so I hope they bring that back in future versions. There's also little raised feet on the back of these covers, so that when you lay them on the table, it just raises the case off of the table slightly to protect both the case and, of course, the camera, which doesn't protrude, but it just gives that extra piece of protection. So this is the Fusion. There's also a very similar case. This is the Air, and it's a very clear case as well. Raised buttons, exactly the same, exactly the same access to all of the ports. This one is just of a thinner material, a more pliable type silicon. So you've got two options here, a lighter option with the Air and a slightly more heavy duty option with the Fusion. Next up, we have got the Rink Max, and this is one of these dual layer cases. I'll just turn this round. We've got this sort of inner, uh, sort of slightly softer, but still quite rigid silicon inside, and then this harder, deep blue metallic frame that sort of clips around the case and just pulls everything nice and tightly in together. You can see again, a nice large cutout for the camera. Around here, we've got a raised button for the power on off, which works absolutely fine. Same for the volume up and down. These work absolutely superbly as well. No extra effort required to push them. A cutout here for the silencer switch and of course full access to all of the controls on the bottom. This is more of a futuristic type case. Nice texture to this middle section here. Nice and grippy and plenty of shock and bump protection for your iPhone 7 Plus too. Now, last but not least, we have got the Rink Flex. This is a one-piece case, but plenty of really thick protection on the sides to uh, protect your phone from drops and scratches. We've got cutouts for all of the ports access and, of course, the camera on the back and the silencer switch. Raised buttons with some nice texture to them for the volume up and down and, of course, the power. And we've also got a cutout on the back for the Apple logo, which is really nice to see. If you're worried about scratching this, Rink do also include two small circular see-through stickers, transparent stickers to go over your Apple logo. So that's still gonna remain scratch free. And then we've got some gloss in here with a sort of a carbon fiber type effect down the bottom, the Rink branding just in here. And then this piece of material, which looks like a faux leather, nice sort of grain to it in a really cool blue color and blue complements gold very, very nicely indeed. A very sleek looking case, I absolutely love this one. This is the Rink Flex. So I hope you've enjoyed a look at all of these cases from Rink. As I mentioned earlier, there is a link to all of them in the video description. Please do hit like on this video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in another one very soon.